a bid to avoid the challenge that greeted the 2023 general election, especially the issue of logo. The new Nigeria People's Party has launched a new logo and slogan, addressing party members at the national convention held in Abuja over the weekend. The national leader of NNPP, Senator Rabi Musa Kwankwaso, said NNPP is the best alternative to the ruling All Progressives Congress (APC) and People's Democratic Party (PDP). Hence the need for a new logo, which represents the fight against poverty and the promotion of education. With the new Nigeria People's Party, NNPP new logo and slogan, the national leader of the party, Rabi Musa Kwankwaso, said in the upcoming elections, nobody will be confused about the party's logo. Louding stakeholders for the speedy amendment of its constitution, slogan and logo at the national convention, Kwankwaso said the development will pave the way for its victory in future elections as APC and PDP has failed Nigerians. Earlier in his address, the governor of Kano State, Abba Kabir Yusuf, said despite the over eight months of litigation over his election, his administration had made some appreciable achievements in fulfilling its campaign promises to the people. Today, despite all the challenges that we had in 2023 election, especially the issue of our logo, even my humble self, I found it very, very difficult to identify our logo during the election. And that was why we thought it is very important for us to have a new, in fact, brand new logo for our party. You can see the red at the top, red at the bottom. And without telling you, you all know the meaning of red. Red signifies, signifies struggle, it signifies determination, it signifies commitment to eradicate poverty, to stop this insecurity that we have in this country, to promote education, which of course, even before now, that's our symbol. In order to recover misappropriated properties, and assets belonging to the state, such as houses, institutional buildings, land, farms, etc., etc. Your administration under the NNPP has inaugurated a judicial commission of inquiry to look into differ into all these issues with a view to ensuring that justice is done to the state and to all residents alike. In his remarks, the acting national chairman of NNPP, Ajuji Ahmed, while highlighting the party's vital role in shaping the future of the Nigerian youth, urged party members to join hand to rescue Nigeria from collapsing. Unless you understand your role in society, you can never make a meaningful contribution. The Greeks understood this better by classifying societies into three types of people consisting in the idiots, the tribesmen, and the citizens. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, let us all be true citizens of our country. Let us answer the patriotic call to duty and join hands across all divides and across the length and breadth of this country to salvage our country from drifting into further hopelessness and an inevitable chaos. I make bold to say that all that has been thrown at us has made us stronger and more resolute in our determination to build a party from the bottom up, one that will serve the people of Nigeria and deliver a better standard of living for the people of this nation. Highlight of the event was the appointment of new National Working Committee members and the unveiling of a new party logo and slogan. Kwankwaso said, as it stands, NNPP is the party to beat come 2027 as the third largest party in Nigeria, with about 21 federal legislators, almost 30 state legislators, 
one executive governor and one deputy governor. Imefon Okun reporting for Clevenius. Thank you.